Hello there, how are you? Welcome back to How I Did It. Today's video is going to show how I wired a three way switch into my 12 volt lighting system in the off grid barn. Your power lines come in right here power black, power red, and they feed into these little clips. Let me show you this real quick. Strip your wire, basically you want the wire end to seat at the bottom and then your shielding to be right here at, at this edge. Strip it and then you just stick it into the hole. You'll hear it click like that there and then you just push this down and that just like locks it. Okay, with that in mind, Let's go ahead and we'll take a look at my three-way switch that I was wiring up. Okay, so here we are at the three-way switch. So the first thing I did was brought 12-volt power up. Red is the positive, black is the negative. And then from there, I put it into the little connector. Now, I went ahead and wrapped electrical tape around it. Didn't want to take a chance when I was pushing it back into the box having one of these little you know tabs inadvertently get popped open and then have a positive wire coming out. So put all my connectors in there. Once I had them in there I wrapped it for safety with electrical tape. Alrighty. So what's nice is my power is coming in here and this power right here is going out and it is actually feeding my exhaust fan right there and that just operates by the knob control and it's actually thermostatically controlled as well then I took and started working on the loft light so when you're doing a three-way switch the first switch is going to have the power always come into the bottom brown screw. Then you'll take your travelers. You're going to need two travelers to go to the other switch. And they go on the brass colored screws. And if you noticed here, I crimped my connections. And again, these are just travelers. And this is where power comes in. Now, on the opposite end of it, this black goes to the light. The light's going to be there. It just simply goes overhead here, and it comes down, feeds through a grommet, goes down, and into the box. And it connects in with all the other uh, neutrals. Again, this one actually feeds the fan. This is the power coming in. This is the light. When you're wiring a three-way switch, the first switch gets on the brown screw the power and on the two brass screws the travelers. The travelers are going to go out to the other light switch. Now we'll go look at the other light switch. Okay, just for a heads up, the travelers, it doesn't matter what color they are. It's just two specific wires. You need to come into that box to travel the signal back and forth from switch to switch. So here we have traveler, traveler, and this one goes to the light. So the travelers, again, they go on the top, brass screws. The bottom on the second switch will always get the hot one. wire to the actual light itself. All right, now we'll just tuck it all in there just like a regular light switch. Alright, 
just like if you were at home, you would turn your breaker back on. We're gonna go ahead and put our fuse back in. And I have this breaker here, or this fuse on a timer. That way when I'm not here, that overhead light comes on automatically. And this is the 12 volt timer right here. You can see it's showing that it has power to it. All right, moment of truth. We're going to go up there and see, well, we'll start at the bottom switch and see if it turns on. Then we'll go to the top switch and make sure it turns off. Here we go. And here we go. <gasps> there we have light. Voila. Simple little 12 volt LED light switch. Or light strip put into a 110 housing that I liked the style of it. All right, let's check the other breaker or the other light switch right there at the head of the stairs. And there we have it. Three-way 12 volt. Alrighty then, that's it for this week's episode of How I Did It. We'll see you next week, or I should say next year, for a new episode of How I Did It, including continuing our framing on the loft area of the off-grid barn, and how I convert my 110 lights to 12 volt. Alrighty then, y'all have a safe and happy holiday season. And we'll see y'all in 2020. Thanks for watching. Have a blessed day.